What defines an outbreak? When should the public be concerned about one? A rural school district lobbied against its own public health department this past week, asking them not to declare a COVID outbreak at their high school. The Elbert County Public Health Director says there are certainly enough cases to alert the public. The Elbert School District Superintendent Day accused public health leaders of not offering the whole story. So Steve Steger went to Elbert County to sort it out. The health department here in Elbert County says they first identified an outbreak of COVID at Elizabeth High School last Thursday. At least 15 cases in students at the school and at least two cases among staff members. When the health department gave district leadership a heads up about the outbreak, the superintendent wrote the health director asking him not to declare an outbreak at the school. He said the district had done its own investigating, only found at the time three cases tied to a single classroom, activity or close contact. The state health department now defines an outbreak as five or more cases tied to a single classroom, activity or close contact. Albert County's public health director, Dwayne Smith, says he waited a day, consulted with the state's epidemiologists who agreed it was an outbreak, then declared that outbreak on Saturday. Today, the superintendent of the Elizabeth School District, Douglas Bissonette, told me Director Smith provided inaccurate information. He says all the information about cases has been communicated, even some information the public health department doesn't have access to. Neither Smith nor Bissonette would talk to me on camera today. The CDPHE told me this afternoon they've identified enough cases at Elizabeth High School to define an outbreak there. The superintendent never got back to me when I asked why calling it an outbreak was such a big deal. The Elbert County Public Health Director says it likely wouldn't change much at the school. It would just give people in the community a little more information about what's going on. Why would they need to know about this? Well, Elbert County's Public Health Director told me today that the vaccination rate in adults is mm -hmm. right around 50%. It's the lower part of Colorado, yeah. uh, you know, as far as adults being vaccinated. So you've got kids going to school then likely returning to a home with an adult in it and potentially carrying the disease to the adults in the home. And, and we know that one of the motivators for people who have been on the fence about the vaccine is proximity An outbreak in their community convinces some number of people. The stats show to finally take the step to get vaccinated, which is why the public health director wanted to make sure he was out front and transparent about the fact that he may have potentially found an outbreak at the high school, mm -hmm. found the, the opposition there a little strange. Steve, thank you.